morning, y'all. It is a great day to have a great day. I'm really excited about today's video because I'm gonna show you some of my favorite shoulder workouts to help you get those cap shoulders. And let me tell you, I did this workout earlier today and when I was blow drying my hair, my arms were shaking. I was crying on the inside because it hurt so good. Yes, I said it hurt so good. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and to subscribe right down below. That way you'll be able to see all the workouts that I'm doing and hopefully they'll be able to help you. Let's just jump right into the shoulder workout. Today's workout is gonna be a dumbbell only shoulder workout. The first workout I did is one of my favorite shoulder workouts and that's the seated dumbbell shoulder press. I did three sets of six to eight reps and I'm really focusing on building up my shoulders and getting that nice round shoulder cap. So my weight is gonna be increased while lowering the repetitions. When you're doing the shoulder press, you wanna make sure that your movements are nice, slow, and controlled, and you really wanna connect your mind to your muscle. So you wanna have that nice mind-muscle connection. Moving on to the next workout, we are gonna be doing the seated Arnold press. And let me tell you, this workout is so brutal, but so good. You will be working your anterior and medial deltoids just like on the shoulder press. The difference between the shoulder press and the Arnold press is when you are coming down in the Arnold press, you are gonna make sure that you are rotating inward. So your palms, by the time you come all the way down, are going to be facing you. And as you go up, you're going to rotate out so your palms are facing away from you. I ended up doing three sets of six repetitions. Moving on to the next workout, this is an oldie but a goodie. We're going to be doing a combination of front and side lateral raises. I do three sets of five reps. So what you're gonna do is you're going to take your right arm and do a front raise, and at the same time, you're gonna take your left arm and do a lateral raise. Then you're going to alternate and do a front raise with your left arm and a lateral raise with your right arm. That is one rep. Moving into our last shoulder workout, we are going to be doing rear delt flies on an incline bench. I have neglected my rear delts for quite a while, and if you want the appearance of a nice full round shoulders, I highly suggest not neglecting your rear delts. I did three sets of six to eight reps of this workout, and oh my gosh, my entire shoulder was completely done. Moving on to our core exercises, we're going to start out with an exercise called the corkscrew. This is going to work your abdominals and your obliques. What you want to do is keep your legs completely straight and you're going to raise them all the way up to the ceiling. Once you get them up to the ceiling, I want you to raise your butt so it is off the mat like mine. When you raise your butt, I also want you to incorporate a twist and that is where the corkscrew comes into play. And you want to do two sets of 15 reps. The last workout of the day is going to be V-ups on the bench. What you're going to do is you're going to sit on a bench and grab the bench behind you. As you extend your legs out, I want you to lean back as far as you can. Quickly bring your chest and legs together into that V position and that is your V-up. That is it for this workout. I hope you enjoyed this commentary. If you did enjoy this video, give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in the next video. And I'm